Look at this. True Tech tools order finally came in. Took a while. Not really. Took a while once it got to Canada. For some reason, our postal service sent it to the wrong place. But what do we got here? Jim Bergman was nice enough to allow me to have his uh, prototype True Blue Kit. What a nice guy. On top of that, my meter came in. saying just to glue it because it's a prototype but there she is bought myself one of these little cord depressors these are going to be cool to have show you how those work later and then I wanted to have a 90 degree fitting just in case sweet thank you Jim we'll open up this in a bit see what's crack a in here Hey guys, I loaded her up. Here she is. So I got my gaskets, got my nylog, a little coupler here. This is that uh, cord depressor that Jim was talking about. Really cool. So you hook it up, and it's basically like a service valve. You back, you know, you can back out the seat here. And then, uh, I don't know, you know, connect whatever you need to connect on the quarter inch port. And when you're ready to pull to uh, read pressure, you just dial it in. It uh, depresses the schrader and allows pressure to come through. Probably use this even with uh, my smart probe on the high side. Got myself the 90 degree fitting just in case. I work on a lot of Lennox. It could be a pain getting in there sometimes. Um, came with both the AccuTool uh, core depress or not core depressors, valve core tools, which is awesome. This is an old T yellow jacket. I thought I'd throw it in here. Reason being is I use a uh, yellow jacket uh, five CFM bullet pump. Doesn't have a uh, a, a valve. Uh, to close the pump on shutting off and it sucks oil back into the hoses if you don't do it properly so I thought I'd just throw this in there that way I could you know close the valve shut the pump off etc I got my two Appian core tools I don't know which ones I like more the uh, AccuTools ones uh, I, I seem to like more simply because of the uh, the angle on there some more fittings and then of course uh, you know this bad boy I really wish I went with the pro version I mean this one's fine it still does all the Bluetooth it just doesn't have the auto approve algorithm and a couple other things that was too cheap a little pricey getting things shipped up here to Canada so yeah that is that thank you Jim <clears throat> then I got this bad boy to play with Customs must have beat my box up. So what do we got here? Here's the meter. Oh yeah, that's pretty big, eh? Huh. Pretty cool. 
big clamps on it. I'm going to be doing some tests on my furnace probably later on if I get a chance. Daughter's sleeping right now. She's sick, so I'm at home with her today. That's the meter. AC line splitter. Pretty cool. Battery. There's the uh sorry, it's kinda hard to do this with one hand. But uh nice little bag. Here are the probes. Decent enough. comes with the uh, alligator clips. Very nice. Cool. So there you have it, folks. Let's see if we can put it on. I don't think the battery's in there right now. <coughs> Very excited to use this with MeasureQuick. We'll see how she goes. We'll see if I can get you a video of it in action.